There's a place where leaders can be found and can help out developing the best of people in their personal growth and development. Where you can receive your DPD or MPD, Master's or Doctorate in Personal Development. Hey, I'm Jimmy Hendrick, and this episode is called Toastmasters is for Leaders on Empower Your Pattern 2.0. Hi, I'm Jimmy Hendrick, Success, Confidence, and Thrive Coach, member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, and proud founder of the James Hendrick Empowerment. There are patterns I know that will help you receive more, help you live a better and extraordinary life. I also hope to give you these spiritual and temporal tips to help you overcome the adversities in everyday life. Okay. Many of you know how much I love Toastmasters and how much I support it. I joined Toastmasters on January 23rd, 2019. With a little help of some friends. Uh, My good friend Jack. He's been a wonderful uh, wonderful mentor to me. A big help. God bless him. He's he's, he's a good man. Um, And also had received mentorship from a a one-time member member that we had. Janine. uh, Janine. She's an awesome lady. You know, as of this term, July 2022, I am now the Vice President for Public Relations for Odessa Toastmasters. And those of you listening to this, the sound of my voice, if you're listening to this on Tuesday, just know that every Wednesday on the second floor conference room of the Truist Building, T-R-U-I-S-T Building, in downtown uh, Odessa, we are we are, are going to be having an Odessa Tall Specialist meeting Wednesdays at, at uh, noon. I'm going to think of the beneficial place to go because Tall Specialist is a place where leaders are made. At some point, we're going to try to get the technology up to make it a hybrid meeting so we can get more members to come. Because I'll tell you something. Toastmasters has Toastmasters has developed me. You know, you've heard me mention on occasion my book, The Winning Personality, a values-based approach to entrepreneurship in this economy. One thing that helped me get it published was the wonderful mentors and friends that I had in Odessa Toastmasters. A big help. God bless them. I know... I know for sure that the Lord blesses Toastmasters. Um, it was there for me during COVID. All the news and, and the family and the per- family and personal lives of people getting reactive. It was crazy. Twenty twenty was crazy time. We all know that. But Toastmasters saw me through. And for the July 2020, 2020 to 2021, I was the vice president of public relations, and then I was elected as president of the club. I don't feel like I did as good a job as I could have. But that being said, I'm going to say this, guys. It is wonderful. It is wonderful to be a part of Toastmasters. You, you learn a lot. You develop a lot. You grow a lot. One of the things I suggest you do is you want you to go to Toastmasters International. Once you look at their, their magazine, their magazine articles, you're going to learn some things about communications and leadership skills that are going to benefit you in so many ways. See, that's one thing that is always going to take place is a partnership between James Henry Empowerment and Toastmasters. I love Toastmasters. It's it's really, it's really been a big blessing and happiness in my life. Uh, Toastmasters brings me a joy. 
because I get to lead and serve and bless the lives of people that, that come to the meetings and just really, really build them up and strengthen. Tell Smashers is a wonderful organization. I joined them in January of 2019 because many of you know I want to be a professional speaker. And so until that point, well, even, even after that point, I'm still on the podcast. I'm still on the podcast. But I know that the Lord gives us so much. And, and Toastmasters, I tell you what, the thing you need to be aware of is uh, when you join the club, of course, the, the format of the meeting is always the same. The president calls the meeting to order and then brings it over to the Toastmaster. And the Toastmaster pretty much, you know, governs the agenda and everything. And then after uh, the usual beginning uh, exercises, formalities, like the reading of the vision in, in our club, the Pledge of Allegiance uh, to the U.S. and Texas flag, along with an opening prayer. Now, not every club does that. But this, the format of the meeting is the same. And the club culture of each club, you can see which one is a good fit for you. I know our Desital Smashers, we do have a good professional caliber in training. And that, that the camaraderie, the atmosphere is more informal. Because we want to try to be as welcome as we possibly can to, to bless the lives of people. I mean, tell Smash this is where you can have fun with your gift of gab. Um, but to join Tell Smashers, it's, it's a good job to be, it helps you be a good member, helps you manage things in your life, and, and not slaughter around, if you know what I mean. I know, I'm... <laughs> You've got to forgive me. I say stuff that, that, that maybe I know I shouldn't say. Life is... I enjoy Toastmasters. I really do. I mean, some of the opportunities that they've opened to me, you know, with the potential of possibly someday giving a TEDx talk. Um, maybe someday becoming an accredited speaker. I'm not sure... That that's what I've decided to do. But I want to do some research and make sure. And, and, and see what the Lord has for me. But I'm not going to give up. Odessa Tulsa Masters is, is, is a wonderful place. For, for gathering. Tulsa Masters has helped me improve. Really, if they say that there's nothing that I need to improve. Which, you know, to some extent it's very rare. But there's times when I know, you know, I, I record my videos sometimes, my, my speeches sometimes on videos, and I can look and I can see, uh, whoa, that's very bad uh, stage presence. I didn't, I didn't uh, position myself very well. I talk about stage presence in my last episode of the podcast that I have called Pattern Public Speaking. So get ready. Enjoy some life. Because i tell you something, there is nothing like Toastmasters. Now, I hope you enjoy listening to Empire Your Pattern 2.0. If you like what you hear, please subscribe. Become a member of Pattern Realm. This is Jimi Hendrix saying until next time. Don't just sit there and take it. Build your dreams so you can take it. Do what others don't so you can be what others want. And do what others don't. You can have what others can't. Choose act and pursue happiness. God bless you guys. <laughs>